I'll write, uh, I'll do the count and then 3, 2, 1, let's get it. Alright, All right, cool. Well, welcome everyone to a race between me, Keyford, and Cookies on Toast. Cool. Yeah, this is a Spiral 3 race. Um, what's the goal again? It is to defeat Bluto, the Seashell Shores boss, uh -huh. and to complete the um, the race at Mushroom Speedway, which will require a total of 20 gems. Oh, I see. 20 dragon eggs. Sorry, 20 dragon eggs. Oh, this is really interesting. Yeah, 20 eggs is... 20 eggs is easy. Yeah, it's not uh, just uh, in general 20 eggs, or does it have to be from specific levels? 20 eggs to get into Mushroom Speedway. No, oh, okay. Yeah, they're not specific or anything. Yeah. Oh, and this is also a uh, glitchless run. Yeah. I wonder if I should, uh, I, I should have uh, did a glitchless run against new and but yeah, it's So do you guys play anything uh, except Aspire games? Uh, well, I've been playing a decent amount of Factory with my friend Alex. That game is amazing. What game? Factorio. Ah. It's a game about building factories. Ah, interesting. Yeah. I'm a big... I'm a big... No. Hello, Wally. I'm guessing I missed the start, because... Yeah. You did miss the start, but we're still fairly early on. I've only got three dragon eggs so far. Yeah. And what is the race? Uh, defeat defeat Bluto. Bluto. And, uh. um, win the race in Mushroom Speedway. Glitchless. Yes, glitchless as well. Pro, I'm a, I'm a big fan of the Pikmin games. What games? Pikmin. Yeah, Pikmin. Oh. Nice. Pikmin. Yeah, the Nintendo game. Hmm. Uh -huh. I thought you said Pikmin for a second. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was getting Marshy vibes. Um. I wonder, can I do this? What are you doing? Uh, stuff that <laughs> involves scripting and making sure things don't just immediately break. Uh. Uh, do, 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 do. Interesting stuff. 
Oof, uh, I had a, a lot of fun with Cool Pro yesterday. A lot of fun with Cool Pro. <laughs> yeah. Oof, we played, uh, we uh, talked about interesting stuff. Um, right. They were uh, Gabe and JP, I think, also. And Lyle. Fair enough. I like stayed up to till like uh, one thirty uh, a.m. because of it. Let's name that. Uh, ever play or heard of a game uh, called Getting Over It? Probably, you probably heard of it. Wait, what, what, what game? Getting Over It with Ben Foddy. Oh, that game. Yeah. That, that game that for some reason exists. <laughs> <laughs> I actually like to speedrun it, kind of. Because why not? I mean, go, go for it. Like, it. That's like an interesting game to speedrun, it's just very precise, though, in order to get, like, really good times. Yeah. Like, you'd have to put quite a bit of time into it, being able to, um... Pick, like, the right lines and power and everything. Yeah. I think, like, my best, uh, personal best is something like 10 minutes. But it, it's not too bad. Alright. I don't I still have times on speedrun.com, but I plan to. Uh, let's take that one. Up that. To that. To that. Do that to have that as well. Oh yeah, where did Ratchet go? I don't know. He went to a movie. That's why he yeah. can't. Yeah. Oh. We were gonna race. We were gonna race tonight, but he got. I got delayed, and he said he was going to a movie. Ah, oh, fair. Did you say you were scripting before? Uh, I'm scripting stuff using an awful program hmm. for it, you're, pretty much. So you're into coding? You'll probably, you'll probably like, appreciate it's, this. It's not really like pro. It's not really like coding stuff. I don't. Huh. But did you guys 
here recently about this thing that was found in you know the game Aliens Colonial Marines how it was considered total dog shit? Oh yeah the yeah the coding error. Yeah how it was literally a single character which like it was an A instead of an E and it meant that the AI didn't actually it was meant to target the player but it instead target the play R and that meant that like they were just completely confused but I can't believe they didn't spot that in testing or like any any program I've used though like this is where I get so confused because I don't even understand how that code would compile if it's if it's just pointing to a variable that doesn't exist it, it, it wouldn't cause weird things to happen, it would cause the code to, like, actually not compile. It just wouldn't start. Alright, I'm back. <laughs> right, so where was I? Oh, it's man. not like scripting slash like what well, it's not like coding that you would really like be like writing all the lines and stuff. This scripting yeah. is stuff is pre written for me, it's just I need to basically make it work. Oh, okay. Like this is like scripting AI into a game and stuff. So like scripting custom AI, custom effects, camera effects, all of this stuff. Oh yeah. Like all of this is written into the game already. It's just down to me to make it all work. Is Hopefully. this a project? Uh, no, it's just something I'm doing for fun. No. It's just something I'm doing for a game for fun, pretty much. For well, while my units last trimester, I had to teach an AI how to play a game. Yeah. It. Worked. Like, you, like you, oh, yeah. you, you, you probably would have to like. So you probably had to script like the entire game and then make your AI. No, uh, actually, no, the game was already made for us. Right. And there were a bunch of elements that uh, the AI program could interact with, and then we just had to set all the variable and stuff. So it was it was mostly a whole if this, then that sort of thing. So, so basically, you, ju you just had to make like a really simple AI that could just move stuff around or yeah. something. Yeah, but it had to be... It had to be very good at reacting to things like um right so it had to have some sort of like logic in there then yeah oh. and my my ai worked brilliantly until he updated the game and got rid of an exploit i was using oh, wow. <laughs> when i say i i mean everyone in the class oh. so it makes sense they got rid of it <laughs> and so my ai went from being able to complete 80 to 100 levels to being able to complete 10 to 15 levels. Ooh. But it nerfed, it nerfed everyone's AI, so... It was a perfectly acceptable thing. Oh shit, I don't have enough gems for that. Am I gonna have enough gems in total? What do you think uh, will win this race for? I don't know. Sorry. 
I don't know who will win. Yeah. Then why would I make predictions? I don't make predictions. Okay, I've got to I've got to rethink my route a little bit. If in doubt, just collect the whole bunch of gems. Even if you over collect, it's completely fine because then at least you can do stuff. Well, no, the the issue was that I under collected. I thought that um, I thought that the eggs that the you know the bit in. The la in Molten Crater with the Thieves, I thought that was a lot cheaper to enter than it was. Nah, that's 300. Yeah, I thought it was like 100. Oh yeah, is there a, a, a Crash Bash demo in Spyro 3? Yes, uh, Spyro 1 has Crash 3 demo, Spyro 2 has CTR, Spyro 3 has Crash Bash. Yeah, okay. And if ETD had a demo, that would be in that would be Twok. No. And then AHT would have twins. Oh really? Huh. It would either have twins or Nitro Car. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, Nitro Car released in two thousand three, I think. But Wait, the fact Nitro that Kart? but the fact that AHT and Twin Sanity are basically brother and sister <laughs> hang on hang on Basically, i thought i thought nitro kart was the gba game Crash uh, nitro, uh, nitro kart has a ps2 release and a gba release yeah. oh i gotta try the ps2 one because i loved crash like, nitro kart but i hated crash team racing like g g um gba version has a whole bunch of other uh, extra stuff like yeah. you can play as spyro yeah. and yeah yeah execute I'm not really a fan of racing games, even the Crash ones. Oh. Well, the thing is, okay, if Mario Kart and Crash Team Racing combined, that would be what I want. <laughs> so you mean Nitro like, Kart? <laughs> pretty much. Like, I, I love the whole, the idea of the story and the challenges thing from, like, the adventure mode in Crash Team Racing, but, um, I just... I hate the driving. But the crash race, but the best crash racing game will always be tag team racing. Um, possibly. Yeah. Oh. I, I like tag team, tag team racing, racing is the best. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it doesn't take so... itself seriously. Oh, it's like, <laughs> hey man. Maybe, maybe come racing. It's no issue. So where are you... Whereabouts are you, uh, cookies? I'm fighting Bluto. Ooh, me too. Ooh. But I'm about to die, I think. Well, it depends on how badly. Well, I am very bad at fighting Blue. Uh -huh. Who can beat Pluto faster? Well, it's not just that, it's also a mushroom speedway thing. Which. And who's that fuck up mushroom? Damn it, I. Uh, I almost had it, but then I died, so now I've been set back really far. How many gems do you- how many eggs do you have, not gems? Turkeys won't answer your question, he's focusing on Bluto. Yeah, I've, yeah. I've got 19 and I've just beat Bluto. Oh, well, yeah, you've definitely got So I've got, I've got 20 now. I've only got about 16. My plan was to beat Pluto, get the one at the end of Seashell Shores, um, get the one for the tunnel. And leave Seashell with 18. Seashell with 20. <laughs> well, no, the idea was to leave Seashell with 20, because I got the ones, I got all of the ones in um, Summer Forest. I got all of Summer Forest and it's I got all Damn, he went back to game. Pardon? He went back to Spyro 2. <laughs> yeah. With this. So. Some rad spring, fella. Some rad spring. <laughs> Alright, I've just defeated Blue, but... Start the race. Yeah, I will not have a... I've only got 18 eggs, so the intention was 
um, get to the end of Seashell Shore and then also do the tunnel. Yeah. So what eggs did you get? When I got the ones from Sunrise Spring, they went to Sheila's Alp, they went to Sunny Villa, then Cloud Spires, then Seashell Shore. Oh, you did Sheila. Ah, I was tossing up whether to do her or not. I decided... It's, it's three really easy eggs in a row, so... I know, but I decided... I figured that the gem, the gem requirement would be... would offset the benefits of the eggs. Can you, do, you, can you, do you condone of bestiality? Yes. What? <laughs> so. Wow. Why you said that you would do Sheila? No, or no. You no. Wouldn't <laughs> do Sheila. I mean, if she was a bit more anthropomorphic. <laughs> now that's not an excuse, cookies. That's not an excuse. <laughs> That's not an excuse what? Did you say furries? I think technically you mean yiffers. Nah. Ch Chuckies is saying if she was a bit more anthrop... Uh, anthrop... That can't spell... can't say a fucking word. Anthrop... That! Fuck this shit, yeah. Fuck that word. Yeah. Um... He oh, I thought I thought you were talking about fucking Sheila. Now you want to fuck a word, man? You're weird. I, I just finished. Oof, ah. Nice, did you? Good GG cookies. I'm. I would finish, but a I failed the tunnel about ten times, and b I'm tired as fuck. So you're not finished it. Confirmed to go through. Key. Key, just finish. What, what me? It's actually cheated. Pardon? Maybe Cookie mm -hmm. cheated, so actually finish, and then you might actually end up winning. Oh. Well, no, because if he if he cheats, then he'll get a DQ. Maybe he he did a glitch accidentally. Even though it's anyway, glitched. good night, everyone. I will. I'll upload the. I'll upload my footage to Mega, and I will. Um... All right. Well, never mind. So even if Cookies has not actually done the speedrun correctly. Well, well, yeah. I, I won't. I won't ratchet five because I. Uh, well, no, no, like, if he's cheated, then he'll just get a disqualification. Like you can't no. just say, "Oh, I have, I've finished," and not be finished. I'm fairly certain that's cheating. Uh, Who's gonna edit it then? That's it. I'm going to stop recording. Bye.